Good day. Um, my name is Will De La Isla, and today we're going to discuss how do you manage an access control workbench. This is a new design that we came up with, and we get a lot of customers asking us, how do we make sure our operators wear the wrist strap? How do we make sure that they cannot work at the workstation without validating that the wrist strap is, is working properly? So what we came up with here at SES, we came up with a solution using our relay system to our power strip that none of the items that we're using our tools are functional right now the soldering iron the ionizer even the light we have made it only possible for them to be totally grounded for it to work okay so here's a little bit more detail of what we've done to connect the WS aware to this power SES relay from here we have a, our output relay connection comes to the back of this unit which is a logic terminal so when our system sends out a signal that we are everything's operational these normally off which th this is the whole workbench this whole strip is connected to this normally off so when we say everything's okay this will turn on the adapter which powers the WS aware is on a a circuit that's always on so this is always on it's always reading what's happening on the bench there's another smart circuit that's normally on which could be maybe a light tower or something that you could connect to so it allows you flexibility on setting up your your customized workbench for access control but like we said again here's our logic relay connection to our WS aware we have two normally off circuits we're using the entire bench and that's it so what I'm going to illustrate to you now is once I have my wrist strap and I plug it in that the whole workbench will turn on as you can see now I'm validating that I'm grounded as you can see I'm passing and that the whole system I'm ready to work so this validates that I'm able to use my soldering iron I'm able to use my my um, ionizers and everything that I need to do my job for the day. The other part of this is that the workbench only works when I'm available to work. So you're saving in energy cost, you're saving in so, um, filters for soldering irons, you're saving in, in ionizer maintenance because the ionizer is not going to work only when I need it to work. So this is a huge cost savings and validation of the whole work environment. So as you can see, if something would happen to my connection, as you can see, I disconnect, the whole workbench goes off and the alarm sounds. So now I'm not capable of producing bad product because none of my environment works. So look, at, look for this. This is gonna be shown in many companies. Once I connect back up, now I'm able to validate that everything I work on, that the operator and work environment is grounded. Thank you.